Welcome to the ZF Education Center. In this video, we will demonstrate how to identify the correct replacement lift support for truck caps, camper, marine, toolbox, and other universal applications. This demonstration is not for typical hood, hatch, trunk, tailgate, or window replacement. Step 1. Measure the extended length. Measure your old lift support from the center of each connection point, not from the absolute ends. Step 2. Measure the rod length. Measure the rod length from the center of the rod end connection point to where the rod meets the tube. Step 3. Calculate the compressed length. Compressed length is determined by subtracting rod length from step 2 from the extended length from step 1. Step 4. Identify the connection type on each end. Ball sockets or eyelets on either the rod end or tube end. Step 5. Identify the force in pounds. To find the force in pounds, look at the tube end for the rated force. This may be shown as a four-digit number with an N for newtons or a pound sign for pounds. If the number is in newtons, divide the figure by 4.45 to convert to pounds. Step 6. Visit your local automotive parts store. Your automotive parts store will have a Stabilis catalog with a universal page listing the replacement part numbers by extended length, compressed length, end fittings, and force in pounds. Step 7. Securely install your new Stabilis replacement lift support one side at a time using any of the old mounting hardware only as needed. With your new lift support installed, give it a test. It should open and close with little effort. Finally, while this video covers many of the essential steps in determining how to identify a replacement lift support, it is essential that you read the instructions that are included with your Stabilis replacement lift support. Your new Stabilis lift support is designed to take the wear and tear out of everyday use. Please check the ZF Education Center for more informative videos or for further information, refer to the ZF website at www.zf.com US. You can also find ZF Aftermarket on Facebook and Twitter.